Dinky do my hearties, it's just me, Scotty McClue. Now then, the case for Scottish independence arises yet again. All I would say is, obviously, I'm not a political animal. I never have been. I'm uh, not interested in any of that side of things. However, I've always known that economically, Scotland could do very well on its own without being shackled to Westminster. We're simply not singing from the same hymn sheet. There's never been a case made for the Union. There is no case for the Union. The Union was built on sand, on skullduggery and jiggery-pokery, and we can blame Queen Anne, the last of the Stuarts, for that, for her manipulation. Scotland always has been independent, with the exception of the last 315 years. It's always traded very well with the rest of the world, and in particular with Europe. So, as far as I'm concerned, if we kept our own money, if we pressed on and ensured, and this is a message to the independence parties, be very, very careful. You make it absolutely 100% clear there will be no change in the head of state. We will be keeping the monarchy. We will be keeping Her Majesty the Queen as our sovereign lady and head of state for Scotland and her heirs and successors in perpetuity. So that needs to be made absolutely clear. Any talk of a Republic and independence becomes immediately toast because you'd lose 50% of the vote. You've got to look at the history of the independence movement to confirm this. And I could tell you more about that anytime you like. But let's first just demolish any arguments against independence being made today. For instance, the time is not right. The time is always right for an independence referendum. Any time of the day or night or year or economic cycle or whatever, the time is right. So we're quite happy to have one now. And also it's divisive. I think you'll find it would bring Scotland together. So it's very much the cement that could bind Scotland together and pave the way for a successful future. Anyway, that's where we're at at the moment. So for me, Scotty McClue, take care of you. Dinky-doo.